A local nonprofit organization is working to save two critically endangered animals that you've probably never even heard of. Mission Wildlife is holding a fundraiser next week to raise money for pangolins and painted dogs. Both of these species could become extinct in our lifetime if we don't step up. Julie Scardina of Mission Wildlife joins us now to explain. Thank you so much for being here, Julie. Absolutely. Uh, thank you so much for having us on and, and uh, letting people know about our amazing event, which will be happening October 2nd and 3rd. Tell us about your organization, Mission Wildlife, and what you aim to do at your fundraising event. Yeah, so Mission Wildlife basically helps organizations to save animals and, and species, frankly. We've uh, raised money for everything from uh, kangaroos to uh, zebras, you know. So this year, our two beneficiaries, as you've mentioned, are pangolins and painted dogs, which many people don't know about. So part of it is just awareness raising, uh, having letting people have an outlet so that they can go have fun and donate and help these species while, you know, really learning about them as well. So it's a very unique event. We have live animals there so that people can engage with them, not necessarily painted dogs or penguins, <laughs> but we have other uh, animal ambassadors, many of them rescued so that people can learn and interact with those animals as well. I have heard, process, I have heard of about the big picture. Yes. And the I, things that we can all do to help prevent extinctions in the future. Which is so crucial. I've actually heard of the pangolin and the painted dog, but I did do a Google image search just to get a closer look. The painted dog is adorable. And you know, the pangolin, I think, is it commonly known as anteater? A lot of people might be familiar with, or a cousin to the anteater, or a, a, a type of anteater. Talk about why conservation of these two species is so important right now. Because they're basically the two, two of the most imperiled species on the planet. There used to be hundreds of thousands of painted dogs, and now there are less than 7,000. And they're all only found in Africa, but many less, uh, fewer areas than they used to be found in. So really focusing on these species is going to be important. Um, pangolins are the most trafficked or illegally trafficked mammal in the world as well. What are they so used both for? Both of them have some huge issues. And it really comes down to both, again, awareness of the, situ the situation, kind of like we were aware of what was happening with the bald eagle and the American alligator. We did something about it and we turned it around. So by people knowing more about it and hopefully opening up their wallets a little bit and donating to these organizations that are dedicated to saving them, then we actually all can make a difference. Tell us why uh, the pangolin is so trafficked. It's because of two things basically um their scales they kind of look like as you said you looked them up and if you look at them they look like a cross between an armadillo and an artichoke those scales are very uh, sought after they're used in traditional asian asian medicines uh -huh. and even though it hasn't been proved that uh, they have any healing qualities uh they're 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 actually again very uh, very much in demand. Very and then the second thing is, is that people actually think that uh, pangolin meat is a delicacy. Painted dogs, on the other hand, are considered more of a pest. And so they're hit by cars. People actually shoot them. They're caught in snares. Oh, and both of these organizations are working in their uh, range countries to change people's attitudes about these animals. Well, by thank reducing you. the threat we can actually save many, many animals. Thank you, Julie, for bringing the issue to light. We love your little feathered friend above your right shoulder there. <laughs> Hello, yeah. thank you for joining us. And we're gonna give our viewers a little more information about your event. Thanks Great. for helping yeah, in the conservation have everybody effort. everybody come out. We still have it. We have two events, uh, uh, one on the second All and right. one on the third, and we'd love to see everybody. Thank you so Go much, to Julie. www.missionwildlifeconservation.org. All right. She's reading my script for me. The Painted Dog and Pangolin Party will be on Saturday, October 2nd at Casa de Glory from 4 to 7. Again, for more information, go to missionwildlifeconservation.org.